President Trump and his anti-immigration rhetoric were cited as an inspiration by the white supremacist shooter who killed nearly 50 people last night at mosques in Christchurch, New Zealand, and he made it clear why that was the case this afternoon in an appalling series of statements to media. Unapologetic and unfazed by the senseless slaughter that was committed by one of his supporters, Trump offered some insincere words of condolences before immediately pivoting right back into the kind of white nationalist anti-immigrant rhetoric that inspired the attack in the first place, calling immigrants coming across the southern border an invasion. When he was asked if white nationalism was a serious problem, he said replied with not really and dismissed it as a small group of people who all happened to support him. He could not have made it more clear that he doesn't care about the effects of his racist rhetoric, which were featured prominently in the manifesto of the Christchurch murderer. The killer literally wrote the words an invasion never before seen in history, millions of people pouring across our borders, and said he committed the attack to show the invaders that our lands will never be their lands. It is terrifying and repulsive to see the President of the United States repeating the same toxic ideas the very next day. He bears a great deal of blame for this horrifying tragedy but doesn't even have the decency to even appear contrite.